Okay, Valorant weapon tier list. Instantly. Uh, where's the Phantom? Or no, where's the op? Op right here. Phantom, where's that? Uh, is that the Phantom? Yeah. Okay, op Phantom instantly in S tier. AK. Um. I'm gonna I'm gonna put S tier in my heart, but Phantom. Wait, how do I spell Phantom? Phantom. Here. Put the. I'll put the Vandal right there. Next up, dude. Actually, the Judge is S tier. No joke. Best gun in the game. Oh, same with same with the shorty for its price. These these guns are insane. Um, Odin, I'd actually put it like. Oh, okay. Bulldog C tier. Fuck that weapon. I whiff so many guns with it. This gun is basically non-existent. Odin actually is a good gun on certain maps, but it's very situational. So maybe I might stick it in the C tier. Spectre. Spectre's pretty good. Singer's poop. Ghost is like A tier, I'd say. Frenzy, also poop. Bucky? The Bucky's like the lesser judge. So, like for $900, you might as well just buy the shorty in my opinion. So, I don't think the Bucky's that good. I might just put a D tier. The knife, S tier for sure. Um, The sheriff. Uh, mm, I love the sheriff. I'll put an S tier. Classic, A tier. The marshal, I'd also say A tier. And then the Ares is pretty poop. I'll put an A tier. No, dude. I I hate the stinger. The stinger has not only failed me. I don't know. I, I disappoint. Like, these guns at E tier are basically always a disappointment. I'm going to say this is a different category because the Vandal is either like S tier or it's like all the way at the bottom. So I put S tier in my heart, but Phantom is way better. I can't lie to myself anymore. Like the Phantom is actually better. Okay, so the Phantom. So Phantom better than Vandal. Can you explain why you think that? The reason why the Phantom is better than the Vandal and why I know. Suppressor. You do not see tracers through the smoke. And also the firing range is reduced like 40 meters and above, you don't hear any noises. At pro play, when you're spamming a smoke with a Vandal, you're going to get instantly shot back. Whereas if you're spamming a smoke with a Phantom, you don't get spammed back at all, and you probably will most likely get a kill. Uh, the Phantom one hits at close distance, and basically, if you dank anybody in this game, their screen, like their character's neck actually breaks. So when you dank with someone with the Phantom, you're probably just going to kill them anyways with like another body shot or something. Cause the gun shoots so fast and like, it kind of feels like, I feel like they should nerf the Phantom in my opinion to make the Vandal more in line and maybe like give the Vandal some more accuracy. I, I'm not too sure. Like maybe a better first bullet, but the Phantom one hits at close range and especially on defense. If you play in situations that favor the the phantom which is like 99 percent of the situations then you're gonna like be advantageous using the phantom over the vandal um what else the did i mention 30 round magazine on a suppressed weapon that shoots really fucking fast and one hits at close range the gun is just insane uh the bullets reset really fast as well and if people buy light shield you instant headshot them in the head anyways so that is why I think the Phantom, why I know the Phantom is better than the Vandal. Like, I would use the Vandal. In my heart, I want to use the Vandal. The Vandal is a lot more fun. And I think it's a lot more... It displays a lot more of your skill. But at the same time, there'll be moments when I'm using the Vandal and I try to spray someone. And I get 156 by a Phantom holding an angle. And he, like, literally one bullets me. 156. It's like, why am I using the Vandal if... So another rifle which beats the vandal in every situation possible one hits in the head it takes out the whole concept of the first bullet headshot and most of the time if you're playing attack like if you're on attack and you're using the the vandal when you're in the post plant every single sight is short range essentially short to medium range you're gonna be playing close cubbies like hard tucked in angles you're gonna be playing close to mid-range 
for most of the game. The only time you're really playing long range is if you play on defense and you make yourself play long range. But most of the time when you're playing that, you just get smoked off. And then if you try to spam through the smoke, then you get killed by a phantom. So, like, I don't, I don't understand. I, in my opinion, the phantom should have a lower bullet count and it shouldn't one hit in the head. Because it has a suppressor, you're able to freely spam smokes. And if you've ever been spammed through a smoke by a phantom, you have no idea where you're getting fucking shot from. You can get shot from any angle. You have no idea. Because the tracers don't show up. Whereas, like, the Vandal has less bullets... It just make it better, in my opinion. If it's similar to like, I'd say like the CS:GO like A1S. Imagine if the CS:GO A1S one hit at close range, and also had a bigger magazine than the AK. It just wouldn't be good at all. And not like good. I mean like the A1S would just be the better gun, which I would say it is the better gun in this game, the Phantom over the Vandal. But I, I, if they want to balance the rifles out, because I'm pretty sure the distribution of rifles is like 99 percent. Phantom, and then the 1% who is probably Scream just uses the Vandal. Like, Scream is the only player that I can think of that consistently uses the Vandal. I really wish the Vandal was more viable. It, the, the Phantom's just too good not to use, essentially. The, the A1S, or like, the Phantom is basically if you combined the really broken AUG in CSGO with the A1S. It's just the, it's a super gun. Then why not buff Vandal instead of nerfing Phantom? Because, like, how, tell me, how do you think the Vandal should be buffed, in your opinion? And then, like, what buffs would make the Vandal more viable than the Phantom if the Phantom still beats the gun in every way possible? You can do a better full first bullet accuracy update. It won't really do much. The Phantom's still going to be better. You can increase the mag from 25 to 30. It's not really going to do much. The Phantom's still a better weapon. Um... You, you probably wouldn't fuck with the accuracy or the fire rates that much. Like, coming from, like, probably, like, a dev's perspective. So, my option that I'm thinking of is, like, you just lower the bullet count on the Phantom. Or just make it not a one hit. And there you go. Like, I, I, I never understood how the Vandal has less bullets than the Phantom. Because the Vandal's already hard to spray. So, like... Those extra bullets could really help. Whereas the Phantom, you should be punished for just full 30 bullets spraying an angle as someone's coming at you. With a suppressor, close range headshot, like all the benefits that a Phantom gives you, and it gives you a 30 magazine on top of that, whereas the Vandal only has the 25, it's it's bullshit. <laughs> it's just it's so much better. I, I don't even know how to explain it. Like if you're a Vandal user, please try using the Phantom. That shit is so easy compared to the Vandal. Like, actually so easy. Heavy Pen? That, that actually might be good. Heavy Pen could be good, but... Oh, yeah, Heavy Pen would actually be nuts. Hold on. Ooh. I would, I would use the Vandal for sure if it's Heavy Pen. Because, like, a scent, you could definitely wallbang with it. Heavy, heavy Pen would be nice, yeah. Because then they'd fit more in line with, like, the gun being powerful. But then, like, it makes the Guardian kind of obsolete, if you know what I mean. I mean, the Guardian already is obsolete. Like, nobody uses the Guardian, but what's the point of the Guardian, then, if you do that to the Vandal? Because each rifle is supposed to be unique in its own way. The Vandal is supposed to be, like, one-hit headshot automatic rifle. The Phantom is supposed to be one-hit headshot suppressed rifle. <laughs> no, the, it's, like, suppressed rifle. And then the Guardian's kind of, like, the high-penetration, slow-fire rate rifle. So I don't... If they did that to the Vandal... Nobody would touch the Guardian ever. And so... That's... Like... You don't want to just completely ruin a gun. And just make the gun, like... Obviously the worst choice. And I think a nerf to the Phantom like that would definitely make more people use the Vandal. I don't know. I just hate... Whenever I use the Vandal... And then I don't hit a headshot. And I do three... Like... Three hits for like 111. And then some do with the, the Phantom just does five hits on my body for 156 within like the the two shots that i take out with the fan the vandal if you do that make the guardian cheaper but if you make the guardian cheaper like you don't want to make it too cheap because you're gonna fuck up like the entire economy system